Fully, oh my god, bro. I swear to god, bro. Every time, uh, at least uh, the German Open, they haven't had it. But I, I see this person on every EU stream because they play Blackwing. <laughs> but we got we got Julius here. God, yes. God, yes. Playing Salad off of the plant deck now. So now they're comboing. Yeah, that's a... One bad thing, you know, like I said, you play a rogue deck, people are going to have to read your cards. Every single one of them. Okay, so they Valor that. Wow. They set and pass. Kind of gaming on YouTube for the Blackwing guy. Yeah, I, I've heard of him, but I, you know, I mean, I, personally, I don't do any Blackwing research. Personally, I don't. Personally, I don't. But, yeah, they're going to go ahead and activate Circle. And then, wow, they read circle. Yeah, it's going to go ahead and search out Gazelle, probably. Ash, yep, yep. Ash in circle is standard. And then, you know, hopefully they at least have something. At least, like, a, a spinny, a Jack Jaguar, insane read. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh no, Salad is rogue. I'm not gonna lie, Salad's like mega rogue. Like this, this deck hasn't even popped off since like 2019. But they're gonna normal summon out Jack Jag. Well, I guess the start of 2020. And then Jack Jaguar and the Banelinks, Banelinks effect. Go ahead, search out Sanctuary. They can relink, summon out Jack Jaguar. They have Hita, they have Princess, they have Raging Phoenix, but Raging Phoenix isn't that good if we have to relink off early. We're not using Baylinks to search. That means we already have Sanctuary in hand. That's unfortunate. Do we have... Do we have Gazelle? Okay, no. We, we drop Spinny there. So boost the attack. Okay. And then Spinny effects. Summon itself back out from the grave. And then Spinny will go ahead. Link off. Make another Baylinks. Yeah. That's good. Because now we still have the relink for the Raging Phoenix. And we can also go up into like Sunlight Wolf instead of going in the Hita 2. And then we can get Jack Jaguar put back, special. And then. Uh, we don't Sunlight Wolf add back now. Uh, we could re. We could link off Jack Jaguar to make Bane Links. And then Sunlight Wolf add back Jack Jaguar to have like a normal summon for next turn. To play a little bit safer into the back row if we don't have a play for next turn right away. But I don't know what their back row would be. Maybe it's just like, uh, it's like Imperm. Okay, relink Wolf and the Wolf, and then Wolf Effect to try to add back Circle. Yeah, so that's going to go ahead and try to add back for follow-up. Okay, wait, are, did, I was going to say, do they want to Imperm that? Hmm. Does Blackwing set anything else other than Imperm? Do they set like actual trap cards in their deck? I feel like they don't. At least not in the main deck. But now that they went to another wolf, that means they won't be able to relink raging off in the future. So make sunlight wolf. I mean make bane links and sunlight wolf effect to go ahead and add back Jack Jaguar. So now they have circle plus Jack Jaguar for follow up. Make princess effect, they impermanent. Okay, that's fair. And then they're just going to go battle phase, beat over, sure. Uh, maybe Icarus attack? <laughs> uh, I wish. I wish. I wish. And before the OG blackout Icarus attack, sarcasm. I see this black wing guy everywhere. Yeah. Oh! Do, do we have anything to stop this? No? Okay, so summon, effect, go search. Yeah, they're going to have read over that again okay and then special summon out and then use that effect that goes through wow that's not looking good for salad at all now i can't lie not looking good for salad at all now maybe they should have and try to instead of trying to relink off sunlight wolf maybe we should have tried the you know guarantee princessing graveyard we have to have another interruption though, right? Well, the set's gonna be circle. So they're gonna go ahead. Wait, is that the OG? 
Blackwing? I'm pretty sure that is the OG Blackwing. GG, it's either never bossed. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know how many cards Julius has in hand. It's gotta be a good amount though. But they also like didn't get to search off Bailing, so that's one less card that they have in hand. So summon out Bora, which is the foolish. Mm-hmm. So they're gonna dumb wait, that's the pop whenever they synchro. Or if they control a black wing. God, I I don't even know what these cards do exactly. I I'm gonna have to pull up I'm gonna have to pull up the TCG player again. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I gotta pull up the TCG player again. I wanna, I wanna be able to commentate this better. But also, finding like a black wing card quickly when there's 248 results. Pfft, kinda OD. Kinda OD. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to find this. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna have to pull up DB. Yeah, so I can actually like look up the levels of them whenever I look up black wing. Okay, so they make a disc pattern. This pattern's really good there. Oh, the stream like lagged there for a second. That wasn't on my end, end too. That was on their end. So, this pattern's like almost just guaranteed game. I guess they have three in hand. So they could have like Nib plus Valor. We gotta make the full armor guy, the big one. Okay, I got the black wing stuff ready to be pulled up whenever I need to look at one card. I guess I'll read the synchro real quick. So, the synchro is unaffected by other card effects. Each time your opponent activates its monster effect, put one, put one wedge counter on it. After that resolves, once per turn you can target one monster your opponent controls with a wedge counter, take control of it. Once per turn during your end phase, you can destroy all monsters on the field that have a wedge counter. Oh yeah, that's the card that beats Flunder. That's the card that makes it to where Flunder like, has like an impossible time. And then... Okay, yeah, I want to look at that one. So, that one is, if you control a black wing synchro monster, quick effect, you can banish this card from your graveyard, target one face up card the opponent controls, destroy it, you can only use this once per duel. Okay, so they have a pop already, and they're gonna bounce to summon Zephyrus, they lose 400, now they're gonna use those to synchro off, and then go up into Chaos Angel, and then Chaos Angel effect to banish the set, which is just gonna be circle. So, I mean, they can chain it, or if they don't have anything here, they could also just scoop. Okay, so they're going to activate the circle there in response. Yeah, go search out, oh, sure, search out mirror, mirror effects summon itself out. That won't be enough. They're not going to dispatter that, right? Oh, they do dispatter that, that's wild. I guess, I guess you, I guess Rock, I was gonna say, I guess you don't even lose to Rock, okay, they didn't stop it. I see Rock in their hand, but I guess you could just simply play around Rock at this point. Because you can actually just, like, battle face to out Princess, you don't have to out it by card effect and still go for game. Because if you, like, you know, pop Princess during, like, the main phase or something, then, wait, they're gonna pop Sanctuary? Sure beat over mirror uh they're gonna bailing to protect okay uh, also it doesn't activate yeah so that won't gain a counter um and then they can go ahead wait that's not even the one that gains a counter that's the one that burns each time they use a monster effect yeah 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 then they're gonna beat over mirror beat over the princess and then go ahead and attack. So they have some burn damage going in. I'm actually really surprised that there wasn't a way for a game there. They, like, they probably should have actually just dispattered to stop Mir. And then just gone battle phase. Because what's the punish at that point? What do you get punished by? Right? There's like nothing that punishes you. Or instead of popping Sanctuary, they could have popped the Mir. 
so that way they get more damage in than what they did so i mean that's that's 35 more damage if you just don't pop sanctuary i don't know i don't know i don't know kind of sounds like i'm cooking but okay yeah, they're just gonna go ahead and admit defeat they're not gonna be able to play through all the burn damage there when they're at like nothing but okay on to the next game now we will get to see salad go first yeah so i put warlords goes in their deck Oh, Gozen? Yeah, Gozen's not the greatest against the old Dark deck. I guess you just try to flip it. And, and uh, well, I guess you just summon Weasel to their field. And then flip it. And then if they try to crash Weasel, you can just go field spell, drop your guy down to zero. So that way they can't crash into it. So that way they, they're locked in the fire and then you win. Okay, yeah. I would also put Gozen in. Circle, grab out Gazelle. And then normal summon out Jack Jaguar. Kind of wait, if they're not main decking Warlords, they're an animal. Warlords is broken right now. Any deck that can main deck it probably should just be main decking it. Now they're gonna go Banelings Gazelle special, go search out the Sanctuary, and then they get Gazelle effect to go dump. So they could dump like Spinny, that's Mirage Stalio setup. Or I guess set Roar if we wanna try to get both traps set up. Okay, dump spinny, summon spinny, overlay, and then Mirage Stalio, and then Mirage Stalio effect. Oh, I see Ghost Ogre in their hand. I, th I think I saw a Floodgate too. Um, okay, does the opponent have Rock? If they have Rock, that's, that's tough. So, detach, go special. That can bring out the Salmon Grid of Fire. Salmon Grid of Fire effect goes search. Yeah, now that can go ahead and grab out Weasel. Yeah, th this combo resolves, it's going to be very strong. Especially with the Floodgate set. That's just going to be game. Uh, hey, did you see my DM by any chance, bro? Um, maybe. Maybe. Where'd you DM me? If it was on, like, Twitch? Nope. I'm gonna go search out Weasel. I cannot imagine bringing Sal to an event right now. Like, he just stealing anything in your deck just sounds awful. I mean, hey, that's the same thing for Snake Eye, though, right? But it's actually worse, because, like, I'm trying to go he just steal your Oak, your Ash, your Poplar. I'm trying to steal anything. I'm not gonna cap. I'm not gonna cap. That's just game. X? What's that? Oh, Twitter? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I forgot. I forgot. No shot people actually call it X. But no, nah, I, I probably not. Probably not. I I don't I don't really be looking at messages too much on Twitter. I don't I don't use Twitter like that. But they're gonna summon out and then sunlight wolf effect. Grab back gazelle. Oh, uh, the problem is Snake Eyes the best deck in the format by far. Salad is not. I mean yeah yeah yeah. But like the Hita thing doesn't make sense. The Hita thing doesn't make sense because Hita is better versus Snake Eye than it is Salad. For sure, for sure. But also, if I'm going to a regional, I'm pulling up with Runic Stun. That deck is the best deck at a regional by a mile, without a doubt. That deck is crazy, because you got Runic cards, so you beat all the rogue decks. You got Floodgates to help beat all the real decks. And, like, it has good matchup in the Snake Eye decks, so you can beat those decks fairly consistently. Is it the best deck overall? No. Definitely not. And there's also people that have now started the main deck Fenrir in their deck, which is really tough. Uh, he just doing anything to make Princess when they otherwise shouldn't be able to seems bad to me. I don't know. I, I feel like uh, like mo most decks just play Fires and stuff. It's honestly fine. Like, I'm perfect. Like, people always talk about, like, oh, you shouldn't be playing Ash in your deck because if you Ash the opponent turn one, they can Hita steal it. I'm leaving, I, I, I'm leaving Ashen for sure. You can use my Ash to combo if you want to turn one. If you gotta use Heat to turn one, I'm fine with that. I mean, it sucks I give you an extender if you need it, but like, I'm fine with it. Oh, they have Rock. Ha ha, ha ha, ha ha. Well played, that is tough. Uh, that is very tough. Yeah, they're gonna calculate the stats of it. I'm pretty sure I saw Warlords in their hand though, so... That won't even work, because they're going to crash Rock in the token, because they're smart and they summoned it in attack position there. Yep, yeah, if they would have summoned token in defense, that would have been a lot more rough. So now they're going to go Weasel, special summon out. 
They also dropped Rock rather early. There was like no point of dropping it there. I guess they didn't want them making the first Raging Phoenix, but they could have let them make it. Especially because they knew that they had Weasel. Uh, basically, I found out that one Diabolster makes Vampire and the Curious for Tiro and Master Duel, and I wanted an opinion because I'm not very experienced. I, I, don't, I don't play Master Duel, to be honest. I hate Master Duel. I, it, it, it's probably not good because Maxi. But I, I don't play that game. So they're going to go ahead, Princess, Pomp, Bailings Protect, sure. And then they're going to link off. That can make the Raging. They still have Sanctuary to relink. Uh, yep. Yeah, they're just letting them know what Raging Phoenix does. I guess the first effect of it, sure. Maybe I'm just a hater. Maybe, maybe. Okay, Raging Ghost Search, Chain Veiler, Chain Called By. Ha! <laughs> So, okay, thanks anyways. Yup, 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 no worries, no worries. But they're gonna go search out Roar. So they have, what, Roar, Ash, Ogre, Floodgate. And they summon a fire to the opponent's field, so... They're gonna have to be smart and crash into the token. But odds are, since they didn't know what a lot of the salad cards did, um, they're going to... What?! Okay, their hand must just be bad. Because they could just crash, and then they're no longer locked. Okay, 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 okay. Let's just assume their hand was unplayable. Let's just assume their hand was unplayable. But going on to the next game now. Uh, we're going to go ahead. We can see Crossout going in for the Blackwing player. I know they're not going to have Ghost Ogre in their deck. They're not going to be able to cross out that card. Okay, so... Let's see, what kind of board can Blackwing build? If they can even build a board. Normal summon out Zephyros. Special summon out Assault Synchron from hand. That's not very strong. That's going to end up losing to a hand trap. So summon effect of nothing. Burn for some damage. Extra normal summon out. Uh, why is Runic Stun better in a regional than a YCS? Uh, cause that regionals are gonna play against a bunch of bozos, and runic stun, like, you have runics, so you, you have six MSTs in your deck. So you're gonna play against all the whack decks, and those are just, like, the buys. Like, I played against, like, the Raid Raptor, Ubul, you know, like, you, you play against that stuff, you, you just auto-win. Cause, like, what, what is Ubul supposed to do, you know what I mean? Like, you, you just absolutely cook rogue. But I'm not, I would not play that deck at a YCS. And then, okay, so they imperm the nothing. That's just gotta be it, right? I feel like their hand was pretty weak. Oh, okay. A Druus Worm? Sure. Is it like a rank 6 technique? Zephyros to bounce back Druus Worm? Is it a link technique? Okay, bounce back, special, lose 400. Sure, sure, sure. And then get rid of those bodies. Oh, okay, sure. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. SP, go banish, imperm. That's fine, that's fine. Is this event over or is day two still happening? Uh, th this is just round three of the tournament. I don't, there's not gonna be a day two for it. It's just a regional. But they're going to activate Druus Worm to go ahead and banish. I mean, it's either you hit a Zephyros that's already used, or you hit the other one. Okay, so they just hit Zephyros that's already used. You're definitely supposed to banish the Synchro there, right? Because, like, the one Synchro banishes to summon out. I'm pretty sure it banishes Blackwing Synchro specifically. Uh, Druus Worm can deal with SP, and then we could combo. Normal summon out spinny. So battle phase, beat over, attack. That's 19. I see Valor plus Druus Worm in their hand. Link off spinny. Go up in the Bailings. Bailings go search. Grab out Sanctuary. Uh, why didn't they use it before? Uh, use what? I'm gonna go search out Sanctuary there. Sure. And then... 
Benny can special. The opponent doesn't have any fires in graves, so we can't go in, up into anything like that. Uh, Druus from on Zephyros. Oh, they're probably saving it to like actually try to like interrupt the opponent a little bit better. But uh, I, don't, I don't know. I, I doubt Julius knows exactly what the Black Wing deck does. Neither do I. I thought they were going to try to make like a Raid Raptor link there. So to be honest, I, I would have ended up Jerusing the Zephyros because I thought that was coming down. But that did not come out. So now they're just going to go ahead. Okay, they're going to make Princess to try to summon back out. Okay. I mean, they have Valor. So they're going to Valor the Princess. Alright. I see Sanctuary. Rage in hand. So is it just set pass? But they don't have any salads set up for Rage now. It's a little bit tough. He was saving it for later in the combo, but the combo is already over. Yeah, they definitely expected the combo to keep going. I thought the combo was going to keep going too. Oh, 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 okay. Activate Mirror. Discard Rage. Special Summon out. You probably just... Uh, that is weird. Because either you make Raging Phoenix, Raging Phoenix. Or you could make Sunlight Wolf, Sunlight Wolf. And add back Rage. It's probably just better to make Raging Phoenix low. Yeah, it's probably better just to make the Raging Phoenix low. And then you also get like Body back. Yeah, it's so a Raging Phoenix, Sanctuary, Raging Phoenix, Effect, go search. And then that's going to go ahead, grab out, oh, they're looking at Will. I guess they can grab Will, activate Will, send. But they don't have enough salads. Because if someone's in defense that they send. So what's good, Austin? Seeing you in North Carolina. God, yes. God, yes. I will be there for sure. I'm going to be playing up. Uh, bunch before that YCS. I wanted to play in the Remote Duel Regional today, but I didn't have all the cards for it. But I'm going to be playing in the Remote Duel Regional next weekend. And then I got to see if there's another Remote Duel Regional. I got to see if there's any Regionals. I'm just going to get infinite, like, tournament practice before I go. Like, like not DB practice. Like, card, like, in real life practice. Oh, uh, the tier guy that was round one said the tournament report that he was running Vidos, the Ashen card. Got like the, <laughs> like the one that pops the fields full. That's wild. I, I don't, I don't, I don't think that is very good. But hey, they were running tons of hand traps. Is this Rika God YCS champion Julius? Yes, this is the uh, the Baba Wagon Julius. The guy who could not beat me in a Fortnite one v one. Nah, I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. But they're going to go ahead and summon out Gazelle, add back Mirror, Gazelle effect, go dump. That's good. They're actually comboing off a lot more here than I thought they would have been able to. There's also like no time left. Oh my god, where did all the time go? There's no shot. There, there actually hasn't been like any plays this match. But they're going to go dump Foxy. It feels like it's been so fast. Bro's gonna go on a four win streak with Runic Stun. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> nah, I'm, I, I, I don't, I'm not gonna play a Runic Stun in a remote regional, cause uh, people will probably happen to draw their back row hate a little bit more. So. And also, I don't think that deck's very great. <laughs> I think Runic Stun's like okay, but everyone's like playing Fenrir now. Cosmics, Lightning Storm, Harpies in their list. There's like a lot more back row hate. People actually are learning how to play against the deck. They're not just throwing their monsters out on the field in attack position. They actually are learning how to play against the deck. But okay, they're gonna go ahead, Simon, go to Fire, go search, and then Princess, Mirage, Stalio get linked off. Okay. Makes a Raging Phoenix, Mirage, Stalio, bounce back, Simon, go to Fire. Link off to to go make sunlight wolf sunlight wolf add back rage Yeah, I mean honestly just rage is going to be very strong. We know the opponent has Druus worm though, so uh, We do have bailing and graveyard though so we can protect our monster from battle and then we can raging Phoenix pop whatever else they do and their turn one was 
pretty weak already. So they can't have too much here. They're gonna go activate Druus Worm. Uh, go banish. Special summon out. Okay. Activate Assault Synchron. Special summon out. That's fine. But yeah, yeah that, 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 that was main phase two. They had to attack over SP to start that turn off with. And now on the Assault Synchron, they're gonna go Princess Pop. Okay. Um. I guess they have a Salmon Grid of Fire in hand that they can send to out. Yeah. Or just Wolf add back, and then that's something that they can send for the Salmon Grid of Rage. Because the Druid Swarm can now out the Sunlight Wolf. So adds back Mirror. Okay. It's just game. It's just game. Normal Summon. Oh. Okay. Activate Effect. Valor. Okay. 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 Now it's game. Now it's game. We just go activate rage. Honestly, we just go activate rage, pop both their cards. What are they gonna do? Druid Swarm, Sun Princess, pass? Sure. Normal summon, effect, game. Yeah, I guess they're just like double checking everything here. Yeah, so target, pop, pop. Yep, pop, pop. And then Druid Swarm, Sun, if they want to, but yep. Game over, game over. Wow, so Salad won there. Yeah, the opponent's just uh, playing it out, I guess. So, Salmon Grid of Fire. They're gonna go ahead. Yeah, bring out the Weasel. Link off. B Link. Sunlight Wolf effect. Add back Weasel. Yeah, they're only at 43. I was gonna say, because. Uh, okay, okay, we're gonna weasel there. I was gonna say, because we also could have went Sunlight Wolf to add back Princess and then just make Princess. And then that's just also, like, insta-game, because you can just bring back out, like, a Raging Phoenix, but this definitely works, too. Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead, Princess, since they summoned out the Foxy there, pop special, and then... They can go Raging Phoenix summon out, sure. Battle game. Yep. Alright, cool. So we see Salad one there. Ah, a wild matchup, right? Salad versus Blackwing. YCS champion, by the way. 